that uh, feeling when Hop is looking at you like you the Galar champion. Oh wait, I am the Galar champion. What is going on people? It is your boy Daddy Mac and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. We're gonna have two Wi-Fi battles for this very special video. We are bringing a really cool Regieleki team. As you can see here, just right after our last week battle on Friday, with our Reggie Drago team. That team was absolutely awesome. And it inspired me to build a team around Reggie Alecki. Now, we are against Roxy, who's bringing a really cool team. A lot of legendaries. Um, both Zacian, I guess you can consider Urshifu as one, Pyobol, and uh, Lando. Who is he gonna start with? I have no idea. That's why I'm gonna start Basculus to start things off. So, um, I got the uh, adaptability. We're running a choice banded Basculin, as you can see on your screen. Throw with the leftovers, Gardevoir with the choice, Scarf, Rocky Helmet, Skarmory. We have seen this Skarmory before. Similar, actually, not the exact same one. And you guys will see why in just a second. We got Lumberry, Tyratrum, and Choice Specs, Regieleki. So I'm really excited to see how we do in these two battles with this Regieleki team. So I'm excited. I'm highly excited. I wonder if you guys are excited. Leave a like if you guys are excited because this team very 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 interesting um i decided to start building some teams and playing around with pokemon i've never used before and that is why i decided to bring the basculin and just like i figured the landorus is going to start things off so you know what i am running on my basculin <clears throat> i'm running the flip turn so i am going to predict that the landorus is going to probably switch out or u-turn or earthquake and i'm just going to counter with the flip turn again i am adaptability basculin I think I'm adamant nature too, or jolly. I'm I'm adamant nature, jolly. Actually, I don't knock out from that range. Interesting. Okay, so I think our best Pokemon to go to now is going to be the Skarmory, obviously, in case the thing wants to hit me with a U-turn, or if it wants to hit me with um, uh, I don't know, a Sludge Bomb. Who? <laughs> what? Sludge Bomb? I'm gonna go ahead and hit the Stealth Rock here. We. The reason we're bringing it throw, throw, throw. Throw! The reason we're bringing Throw is because he has Circle Throw, and my plan is to set up the Spikes and the Stealth Rock with this Garmory later in the game. Now, obviously not right away, but you know. Yeah, so that's the plan with this Garmory. I got the old Wing Beat instead of the Brave Bird and see how that treats us, even though it's lower accuracy with no recoil. So yeah, let's see how that treats us. Um, Obviously, the fire type attack is a thing. I'm gonna go into Gardevoir and try to tank the fire type attack as I am Scarf Gardevoir. And we're gonna try to go from there. So, I don't, this Gardevoir is not as tanky as my previous Gardevoir that I used before. Um, but it is a pretty good Gardevoir because it's Scarfed. Boom! That was too close for comfort. Way too close for comfort. So, what I'm gonna do here is hit this thing with the expanding force. I have no choice, to be honest. I have no choice. This thing is kind of bulky. Yeah, it's taking it. It's taking it. Low sweep. We might live. No, we're not living. We're at 4 HP. Who am I kidding? It's a crit. You know, you never know. That's probably why we died. Or fainted. That's the right term. I'm sorry. Okay, so Pyro Ball was a thing, of course. Um, Regia Lecky is a very fast Pokemon. So we're going to go ahead and hit the Regia Lecky. And we're going to Bolt Switch. I'm, I'm really in love with this thing because we got the Volt Switch and Flip Turn combo. I wanted to incorporate a Pokemon that had the um, the U-Turn to make it an all three pivot, but I couldn't necessarily find a Pokemon. So we're going to go ahead and Volt Switch here. I'm pretty confident that we outspeed and we do. Boom. Knocks it out. And the reason I'm going Volt Switch, I know I get I don't get Switch priority, but I don't want to stay in against a Landorus. Um, that's the last thing I want, to be honest. But because of that... Zacian is a fairy type is the only thing. I'm going to go back into Skarmory here. Mostly because I want to finish setting up my spikes. That is why we're going to go into the boy Skarm. That is why. Did they quit? They turned off their switch. On to the next one. So we found a second opponent in Creaker who's bringing the Dermanitan. Um, I got a feeling it's gonna start with Grim Snarl. So because of that, I want to start Reggie Alecky. Try to hit it with a um, Thunder Cage to start things off. He doesn't have a lot of Pokemon that can take an attack from Reggie Alecky, other than the Kamo, of course. For the Kamo, I got Gardevoir as an answer, 
we are a scarf um gardevoir so hopefully we can take the, the kamo down um with relative ease as long as we don't get a paralyze uh, a paralysis from the grim snarl i think we will be okay um pokemon that do concern me Inteleon, darmanitan and uh como obviously shalom is an underrated pokemon also so that's uh this this is gonna be a tough battle this is gonna be a really tough battle so let's go ahead and see what creaker has to bring to the table um what was i gonna say what was i going to say i don't remember what i was going to say wow um yeah i have no clue Okay, so Creaker is going to bring out the Braviary. So this is actually very, very good for us. So I'm going to bring in the Red Yaleki that I acquired from a trade, which is why it's in a Master Ball. And then um, I think we Bolt Switch out of there. We're going to Bolt Switch out of here. We outspeed the Braviary, no doubt about it. I once brought a Scarf Pokemon. I think it was Ready Drago against the Red Yaleki. And um, Braviary faints. Uh, maybe this uh, Grim Snarl is not a supportive set, and it's a, an attacker of some kind. Okay, so we're gonna bring out Skarmory next. But as I was saying, um, Reggie Lucky is so fast that I brought in my Scarfed Reggie Drago in a rank battle, and it still it destroyed my um, Reggie Drago. Quite frankly, Shaolin Dora comes out, which is actually very very good for my opponents. Um, I don't have a Pokemon that wants to take a flamethrower at this time other than Tyrantrum Tyrantrum's the only exception. So we're gonna go Tyrantrum here. If he goes for the grass type attack, then I'm gonna cry a little bit I'm gonna cry a little bit. Okay, here comes the Tyrantrum Tyrantrum, I'm very excited to use a Pokemon like Tyrantrum to be honest So it's gonna be really really nice for us um, as long as As long as we get a dragon dance off, we will be okay. I really I'm afraid of Shalandor hitting me with something that I uh, that I I'm not prepared for. That's my biggest fear. That's the biggest fear that I have. I started I started playing Fire Emblem Three Houses again, and I forgot how much I love that game. It's such a master. It's just a, it's just a masterpiece. That's all it is. Komo comes out. I'm gonna set up the Dragon Dance on you, big boy, and I'm gonna hit you with the Dragon Claw. I hope you don't Dynamax. I'm gonna be really upset if you Dynamax. Okay, so this is the battle of the dragons right now. I really want a Dragon Claw. We are Rockhead. Um, what's your name? Tyrantrum. <laughs> I almost called him Kamo. We're Rockhead Tyrantrum, so we're gonna spam the uh, Head Smash as much as we can after we get rid of this Kamo. Tyrantrum is a Pokemon I've been wanting to use for a while now, and I'm so excited to see that this Dragon Dance so far is going to pay off. If Inteleon comes out, I'm going to hit that thing with a head smash. If anything else comes out, I'm going to hit them with the head smash. And I'm, I'm really glad that the Grimstar is not supportive. At least from what I know so far, because I'm pretty sure he would have gone out in, into it already. Inteleon does come out. We're going to head smash this thing out of here. I just hope I don't miss. I hope I don't miss. Come on. Head smash. Oh, Tyrantrum. Oh, my baby. Tyrant. Tyrantrum knocks out Inteleon. Inteleon's a very frail Pokemon. Obviously, um, it's going to knock it out. And as you can see, no recoil because we are Rockhead. Um, I have a Rockhead uh, Grim, um, Grim Snarl. I have a Rockhead Tyrantrum, but this one is an ability patch because I didn't want to breed for it. And also, this Tyrantrum's in the Ultra Ball, so what better can it get? Look at this. Another one. Is this a Tyrantrum Sweep? We just picked up a Tyrantrum Sweep. That's going to be a quick video if we do. I am okay with that. I'm really happy with that. Okay, what's next? Watch him rage quit too. Watch him rage quit also. Darmanitan comes out. My boy. I'm going to hit you with that head smash. I'm going to hit you and Shalandor with a, with a head smash. Look at this. Head smash. We hit again. Boom. I love you, Tyrantrum. I've been wanting to use Tyrantrum since Generation 6, and I never, ever, I think I did, no, I think I bred a Tyrantrum and never used it. So I think it's safe to say that we I've never, ever used a Tyrantrum before, and since this is the first time I've ever used Tyrantrum, I am so excited. Okay, Tyrantrum, it's your turn to shine. It's your turn to shine. Hit this head smash, please. 
I'm, this is a tyrantrum sweep. The janitor tyrantrum hits. Yes, that's a sweep. That's a tyrantrum sweep. Oh my goodness. That was so satisfying. Is this a 6-0? I think it's a 6-0. This is the first ever 6-0 in the channel. <gasps> that's gonna be it for this Wi-Fi battle. I know it was really quick. I, I know, I know. I'm gonna take your lead card because you're the first ever 6-0. But thanks, you guys. Thank you guys for watching this uh, Wi-Fi battle. If you guys watch it to the end, I cannot believe we picked up a Tyrantrum sweep. Make sure that you guys leave a thumbs up if you guys really like this sweep because I, I, I don't think I've ever seen a Tyrantrum sweep. To be honest, I don't know if you guys have, but make sure you guys leave a like. Comment your vote down below for hashtag MVP Tyrantrum. You already know who MVP is. And subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battles. It's your boy Daddy Mac signing off. I'll see you guys next time.